to make a curtain, uh, we would first start off with a plane. So this would be the actual curtain or fabric that we would see. And I'd make it two meters by 1.5, just for this demonstration. And I would make sure there's quite a few segments in it. Then I'd create a box. This is what the plane will be tied to. As you'll see later. I'll just move this so that it's in the middle of the plane. And then we'll select the plane and modify it with the cloth tool. Go to object properties and set it to cloth. We'll then use the down arrow, select the group, and then select the top three points on the plane and create a group. We'll then select the node tool and select the box, and then we'll click back onto the cloth, close the tab. And that's pretty much it. So now we can uh, first simulate the cloth and then we can use the scale tool to then move the box on top. And as you can see, the, the cloth follows. And then you can use the timeline to then adjust or create sort of a simulation instead of manually moving it. That's about it. You can then move the curtain around and change the curtain size.